there's been plenty of action on the other end of the political spectrum this week with presidential hopefuls already eyeing the Oval Office. Now, contenders for the GOP nomination have been out in force at CPAC, the Conservative Political Action Conference, and our Deputy Political Director Shoshana Walsh has the highlights. For the GOP, it's a vital stop on what they hope will be the road to the White House. God bless CPAC. So there's not a single Democrat here. CPAC, a gathering of conservative activists, many of them young, and it's where likely 2016 candidates come to try and win over the crowd before they hit that 2016 campaign trail. I did run in track. I was good at the half mile and the quarter mile. Uh, and I've been running three times in the last four years, so I'm getting pretty used to it. But uh, <laughs> Wisconsin Governor Scott Walker, former Hewlett Packard CEO Carly Fiorina, Senator Ted Cruz, Louisiana Governor Bobby Jindal, former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin, and New Jersey Governor Chris Christie, all taking the stage Thursday. Christie said his tough-talking style is just passion, but he had a message for the White House. So more of that stuff should be happening in Washington, D.C., because there's so much ridiculous stuff being spewed, especially out of the White House. Someone should say it's time to shut up. Um, Christie wasn't alone. Almost all the contenders took aim at the president to cheers from the crowd. Stop blaming the victim and wake up, Mr. President. While Christians bow our heads to pray for you, radical Islamists want to cut off your head. President Obama has disqualified himself, but he's shown himself incapable of being our commander in chief. But it was Fiorina who took on the person all these contenders may face off against, Hillary Clinton. She tweets about women's rights in this country and takes money from governments that deny women the most basic human rights. <laughs> Hillary may like hashtags, but she does not know what leadership means. Former Florida Governor Jeb Bush will speak at CPAC today. He's been busy fundraising, and this is his first appearance at a multi-candidate forum or cattle call since he first signaled his interest in a likely presidential campaign. Shoshana Walsh, ABC News, New York.